Hello, welcome to Chris's Beer Reviews. How are you? Hope you're all doing really well as per the norm. So introducing a new little series on my channel. I could just review them like I normally review beers, but I'm gonna give this series a name. It's gonna be the Park Bench series, where I'm gonna be reviewing the strong lagers that you can pick up in sort of corner shops, etc., and that are normally round about between one pound, one pound 50 a can. So it's gonna be the Park bench range of strong lagers which I've been meaning to do on the channel for so so long um, but I never have so now I have I've got a load in and we're going to review them over the time and yeah it's going to be called the park bench series although park bench drinking does that really exist anymore it's more like town centre drinking these days isn't it every major town centre you go to that they're, they're street drinkers but we stick with the park bench it's got a nicer sound to it park bench and we're going to well my aim is is to try and keep these park bench ones quite short as well i'm going to try and get them in about the four minute mark this one's going to be longer because i'm introducing this series but yeah they do aim to be short and sharp uh, reviews so it'd be rude not to start off with a beer that's been reviewed thousands of times i'd imagine and it's going to be going with probably the one of the beers that kind of started it all really the carlsberg special brew lager but i know this has dropped in abv at 7.5 percent it used to be higher it used to be around about nine percent didn't it a few years back but it has dropped um but some of the ones i have got in the fridge are in the nine percent range and i'm hoping to get some in the ten percent as well but yeah why not thought we've got to start with probably the beer that certainly i remember back in the 80s as being the, the park bench beer and that's the special brew lager they've changed the can over the years I quite like the artwork on this. I quite like the look of the can, although I didn't mind the old artwork either. But yeah, I quite like that. So Carlsberg Special Brew, been around for years. ABV has dropped. Let's crack on. Let's get this one out in a glass. See how she looks, how she sniffing, how she tastes. See, like I said, I've picked up a few. I think I picked up four or five from a food and wine type shop, as they're, a lot of them are called. And I did feel a bit a bit wrong buying them because I had my daughter with me at the time. <laughs> I bet the man in the shop thought I was a right wrong and as a parent. Uh, but there you go. Is what it is, peoples. Uh, so there it is in there. Uh, massive carbonation. Really good carbonation going on. No head, but I didn't expect there to be much of a head. But nice colour. Goldeny, coppery colour, but loads and loads of carbonation. Don't know how well you can see that, but there is tons of carbonation in there. Better looking than I was expecting. Let's have a sniff. Not a lot going on. Very malty based. Really not a lot going on on the aroma. Let's see how this bad boy tastes. Cheers. That's surprisingly not bad. That's not as bad as I was expecting but the ABV has dropped um, has got a sweetness to it and a lager I don't really want my lagers to be sweet but this is quite sweet not massively but it is sweet at 7.5 percent isn't particularly aggressive it's quite clean it's quite crisp it'd be even crisper if it wasn't as sweet quite malty has got a maltness to it has got a metallicness to it not much else going on but that's actually not too bad you know the carbonation helps the carbonation works quite well you know it does feel like a, a heavy lager <coughs> and it's very well carbonated but that's not horrendous that's drinkable um, that's not a sink pour for me. I will drink that. It is, it's proper cold. I've got this really, really chilled down, which probably really is helping it. I think if it was warmed up a little bit, it'd probably be quite rancid. But that is proper chilled. And that's all right, you know. It's malty. It's got a sweetness to it. It's got a cleanness to it. And a bit of a crisp kind of feel to it. Very delicate. Slight bitterness, but I think that's a bit of metallic -y. But all round, that's not bad, actually. Carlsberg Special Brew, 7.5% ABV. I'll see you on the next uh, park bench. Take care. Bye now.